Okay, we're gonna suppress. I should have my... And it doesn't matter if he has a reflective shield on, I believe. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're gonna be taking a closer look at this build over here. So the Nodens with uh, these crate weapons, these are the beta weapons, the new ones you can get from the black market. So in terms of the stats at max level, um, here are the stats. So it has a range of 500 meters, 8 second reload time. And also it has damage over time effects. So it has corrosion. And uh, one thing to also point out, um, these are considered energy weapons, which means if you are firing at like the Arthur and it has a shield up, it's going to take you quite a bit of time uh, to break through that shield um, if you compare it to something like, um, you know, the retaliators, uh, for example, or shotguns. Um, but I do have a plated armor. I have cannibal reactors on here. And I think what I might do is to run two games. Uh, the first game is going to have cannibal reactors. Second game, um, I'm going to run antimatter reactors just to kind of compare the two. And uh, who knows, actually, it might be a matter of running, you know, one of each. But um, I think it's definitely worth uh, trying out. And I'll give you my thoughts of it uh, right at the end. So uh, having said that, let's jump into the first game here. And uh, let's see how we do with this Nodens. Okay, so we've just dropped in on carrier map. And um, I have started with the Hellburner first here. Um, this is Beacon Rush. So I'm trying to get some beacons quickly. Try to charge up my, uh, my Titan bar as well. And then after that, we'll... Uh, Drop in with the uh, Nodens. Oh jeez, did you see how much damage we did to that uh, that shell? And it's funny because this is a Hellburner too. Another hit. Uh, my last stand. Oh, that was close. We're going to take out that shell. Boom. Oh man, we got another guy. Another one over here. Can we get him? Scorpion. This guy. Boom. Another kill. <laughs> wow. Look at my Titan Bob. Oh, jeez. What's going on over here? These guys are on this beacon. Incoming. Boom. Got him. <laughs> so um, our titan bar is now filled up I think uh, yeah let me let me try to get center back and then what I can do is I can drop in with that nodens I think they're gonna start dropping in over here actually someone's gonna drop in over here see what I did I ran whoa I sent him flying back I ran to where they usually drop in. That allows me to get that extra damage in. Pretty much for free. I can knock this uh, guy's shield down here. Take out their, their Typhon. Ooh, that was a good hit. They have another... <laughs> they have a Cerberus there too. Incoming! Boom! Yes! Ooh. A lot of stuff here. Maybe I can launch this guy. Ah. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. What's going on over here? There we go. Seal this guy up. Um, I wanted to heal that player up, but... He went into phase shift. See how this guy up here too. So something you're going to notice, um, you know, with these weapons, you actually run out very quickly. Definitely not like um, what it was on the test server. Um, oh, geez, there's so many players here. Trying to switch to that other player there. I couldn't. Guys, our right side. Let's get this guy. <laughs> I 
There's so many purple shields, it's just blocking all my shots. Let's get this one. Ooh, that's a pretty good hit. That's actually some decent uh, corrosion damage there. I have to watch out that Ming's uh, kind of getting closer to me here. Oh, oh, wait. Let's try to get uh, this Ming. Not exactly sure why he dropped into a center like that. I'm going to heal up this Arthur here. I'm looking. Oh, wait. We have a guy above us. I can't see his health. There we go. This Arthur's going to get a heal. Let's try to target that guy. I can't uh, just suppress them. I'm going to heal this Arthur again. I keep running out of ammo here. Um... Uh, now I can't heal him up because there's just so many of them. Uh, yeah, I think he, he got killed. Um, let's see if we can get this guy. Oh, his health. I didn't even see him. That's a thing with Mings. Sometimes... Oh, jeez. Did it link to the wrong guy? No, it didn't. The thing with uh, Mings, when they are flying like above you, you can't see their health. Try to get this guy. When he puts his shield to the front, it's gonna take me a while to actually break that with these weapons. Hold on, hold on, hold on. So you see that? It should be breaking soon though. There we go. Because I have cannibal reactors, so that helps. You have to watch out for this guy here. This guy's gonna need some healing. I'm trying to get uh, closer to that guy. Let's do that. Look at the corrosion. Oh my gosh. Whoa. Yeah, that's going to do it. He's not going to be able to... Yep, there we go. Here's another guy over here. Let's uh, suppress him. Let's go for this guy. He's going to drop quick. Too late. And this guy. do that trying to get a little bit uh, closer here and we can fire at hawks too that's gonna do it for sure there we go let's heal up that guy gonna suppress that Arthur there maybe I can get him yep this angle whoa look at his health Gonna get a little bit closer here, get that corrosion in, that's gonna do it. There we go. Let's move this way. Can I get this guy? Oh! Yes! <laughs> I suppress that player way back there. This Ao Jung's gonna be landing here in front of us. It still does a lot of damage, even with cannibal reactors. If you're talking about the amount of damage it does to regular robots, it's quite quite a lot. But to other titans, man, it's pretty crazy. So 6.9 million damage, 12 kills, 3 beacons in that game. And this is how we stacked up. Okay, so I think what I might do here is we're going to switch out the cannibal reactors, uh, put the antimatter reactors, and then uh, based on, you know, that game, I'm going to tell you, you know, my thoughts, whether you should run. Maybe one of each might be the best combination. But uh, let me go ahead. Let's do that. And I'll see you guys in game number two. Okay, so we've just dropped in on power plant map. And um, I have started with the uh, hellburner first here. Looks like we're going to have a uh, shell in the uh, gap area. So let's try to deal with this guy here first. 
Ooh, that was a good hit. That was a really good hit. Another play over here. We're gonna go in for another detonation. Here we go. Last stand triggered on this uh, shell. And this should do it. There we go. Um, I think I'm gonna go for this beacon here. Got him. We're gonna get this beacon too. And detonate! Yes! <laughs> he couldn't escape that. Uh oh. Uh oh. We gotta go for this guy quick. Yes! Oh, wait, wait. There we go. Got him. Um, wait, is that another... Is that the same guy? That might be the same guy. Uh-oh, we're losing a lot of beacons here. Um, close to half his health. Oh, shoot. <laughs> yes, we got him. Yes, rampage. Oh, man. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Shield, 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 shield. Shield. Oh, come on, get him. Oh, I can get him with the detonation. Almost. A lot of players over here. Let's drop in with our shell just to defend. Okay, I got that guy down to his last stand. This one as well. Let's deal with this uh, player here. We're losing a lot of beacons. We lost the, uh, the gap area too. Trying to get this uh, scorpion. This guy's got to go. <laughs> Missiles. Oh my gosh, we almost killed him. Whoa, are you kidding? Yes. There's a uh, play over here. Let's see if we can try to get him with that. At least we got this beacon back. That's huge. Last stand triggered on him. He's teleporting to the guy down below there. Um, it looks like... No, that scorpion's gonna attack the guys on the right side. We're using another beacon somewhere. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Trying to get this guy quick. Oh! I think there's an Arthur there, right? Let me drop in over here because we do have an Arthur and I can back him up. So let's see how this does against regular robots. It should do really well against something like a Fenrir. I try to suppress a couple of players back there. Let me just reload. Oh, <laughs> my Nodens is like drunk. Hold on, dude. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's see how it does against a Titan. That corrosion is doing quite a lot of damage there. Let's try to help out over here. Ooh, this guy's really low on health. Can we get him? Hold on, hold on. Suppress this guy. There we go. Another one over here who's uh, targeting me. I'm trying to get within the, the 500 meter. Actually, wait. Let's go for this guy. Easier target. Let's do that. I mean, that's pretty effective. You have to remember, this is not cannibal reactors here. You know what? I almost think this might be better because at least you can do a lot of damage to regular robots. That guy. I need a we're going to target this Nodens here first, actually. Oh, man, I got caught. Or, wait, he has his back towards this Arthur. So we can probably get this Arthur. He's going to turn around wondering what the heck is going on. I need to get the heck out of here. Oh, shoot. There's a guy right over here. I can't fire at him. Hold on. If he charges. So wait. Let's 
get him now. I wanted to... Uh-oh, uh-oh. He's got to move around the corner here. I wanted to get this beacon first. Okay, we're going to suppress. I should have my... And it doesn't matter if he has a reflector shield on, I believe. Yeah, it's doing a decent amount of damage. Look at that. Yes. Maybe get that guy. Suppress him. Trying to heal up this guy in front of us. Oh, wait. I think I got him. Let's get this guy. That corrosion's gonna work. Did I get him with disposal? No, I didn't. <laughs> uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. There's my uh, teammates here. Oh, jeez, look at the corrosion on that guy. Hold on, hold on. There's someone healing me up. Perfect. We have to uh, watch that side. Oh! Oh, that's doing a lot of damage. I just suppress him. We gotta watch out. Stay on the beacon. On the beacon, dude. On the beacon. Behind you. Uh oh. He almost gave up this beacon. <laughs> He must have been wondering, why am I pushing him? Yeah, I had to save that, uh, I had to save that beacon. Suppress this guy. This game's getting, uh, pretty intense here. I need to heal up, uh, that player there, quick. Hold on, dude, hold on. Should help. Let's do that. Um, we should be able to get this one here. Where'd he go? Oh my gosh! That Typhon! Yes! Oh, 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 oh! Come on. We gotta get a disposal kill. That guy. This guy. Thanks, dude. Try to suppress him. Heal that guy up. I might be able to actually get this fork here, even though he is in uh, that reflective mode. Uh-oh. Whoa! Uh -oh. oh, man! Okay, maybe not. Whoa, look at the corrosion on him! Okay, he's down to his uh, his last stand here. I'm gonna have to uh, heal. Maybe another heal after this. Can we get him before he goes in the flight? That might still be enough. There we go. Pretty intense game. I'm trying to corner shoot. <laughs> How to corner shoot with the Nodens. Hold on, hold on. Uh-oh. I'm gonna get him with that. I tried to see if I could heal first before. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Heal! Trying to heal before... <laughs> They're gonna end up killing me. Can I drop in over there? Can I, can I? Yes! Yes! Let's get him. We gotta watch out. Oh man, this guy's gonna get me. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, oh, use ability quick, <laughs> 20 seconds, yes, gonna heal just in case, come on, come on, yes, that was a very exciting game, so, you know what, it actually did really well with the antimatter reactors, and I think if I had a choice, I think I would actually do antimatter reactors. So take a look at that score. Oh my gosh. 8.4, almost 8.5 million. 12 kills. Look at the beacons. 11 beacons. So that's how we did in this game. But uh, yeah, I think if I had a choice, I think I would probably do antimatter reactors um, instead because it works really well against regular robots. And it doesn't seem like it's losing that much power against uh, Titan. So I think uh, that is probably the way I would go. Um, in terms of this build, but you guys can let me know your thoughts on it. 
But uh, yeah, I think that's pretty much it. So thank you guys for watching. And until the next video, I'll catch you guys later.